Hey guys, welcome back uh, to our kitchen. It's another episode of Family Meal Fridays. Your host, Catalina, and who are you? Mateo Luis Del Tufo. Mateo Luis Del Tufo. And today we are very excited to make a really simple classic meal with you. It's going to be chicken parmesan with homemade tomato paste. And it's going to be delish. And Mateo and I are ready to start getting the ingredients together. Isn't that right, Mateo? Yeah. There you go. Is it going to be delicious? Okay, so the one thing I do also want to mention is when you are cooking, you can smell when something is ready. So I'm looking at the clock, it says 10 more minutes, but when you go ahead and you just taste it, mm, it's perfect. Oh my gosh, I can really taste the cheese right at the end. My sauce is done. Now it's time to cook our chicken. All right guys, so we went really elaborate with our tomato sauce. So I'm gonna keep it pretty simple. I'm going to use whole wheat flour, put some pepper in it. Um, actually, I'll show it to you. And then we've got our egg, and then we've got our whole wheat seasoned breadcrumbs. We're just gonna dip, 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 and then put it in the tray. Um, when we have all of them, I'm gonna fry them up so they're nice and gold and brown, uh, maybe do like two minutes each side, and then we're gonna finish it off in the oven. It's gonna be delish. Okay folks, so we are at the final run. So we have our sauce. Our sauce is going to just be um, placed on the bottom of a casserole dish So that here now if you have a husband like mine, he doesn't like a lot of sauce I love sauce. So there's plenty of extra left over for me. All right, so in our house We appreciate cheese. So what we did was layered it up with fresh mozzarella and Sprinkled it with what did we sprinkle it with babe? Locatelli which with locatelli a, a creamier parmesan it's a creamier Parmesan. Did you want to get on film? No, I'm good. He doesn't want to get on film. We'll get him I understand on. understand how perfect this chicken is right here. Oh, yeah? This doesn't feel dry at all. Oh, shit. Mm. <laughs> What's wrong? Just changed your world. Mm. So delicious. So what did we do in the end? I'm sorry? What did you do in the end? You might have to be a little bit more direct with your question, because I'm confused. <laughs> After the 30 minutes at 375, we took it out and decided to do what? I broiled the top. How long? <laughs> we got some chicken that's all ready to, to, to be eaten. Mm-hmm. But before I before I took it out of the uh, uh, before I finished it rather, after 30 minutes of baking, I took the top off the foil that is, put it back in the oven on a broil for low, and just kind of watched it for like less than five minutes because. 